It's a pleasure to have on our program a conservative, although, of course, they're lying about him and trying to undermine him, Trent Staggs, who's running for the open seat to replace Mitt Romney. And they have a convention process there, TrentStags.com. That's his site. Trent, how are you, my friend? Hey, I'm doing great, Mark. So good to, so good to be with you. It's good to see you at CPAC. Um, what do you make of these sort of rhinos ruling class Republicans who are trying to pretend that you're not actually who you are? <laughs> well, you know what? I got to hand it to you. You're the one that called it, right? Um, yeah. When we first were on the program, and it's it's true. Uh, so just days after me calling for Mitch McConnell uh, to that, that I would not support Mitch McConnell, and I rallied many other of the candidates in this race to commit to do the same because I think voters deserve that. They need to know where somebody is going to stand. You know, days after that, they try to come out with some attack piece and and try to say that I'm not a conservative and that I affiliated with some other groups that were questionable when we've got many conservatives that have done the same. Um, that's just what we expect. We expect them to do that. The establishment is definitely scared. Uh, they don't want me in office. Uh, they know that I'm somebody who's going to stand up, I'm going to push back against the cabal. And, uh, you know, but Utahns, they're smart. They know that. Mm -hmm. uh, they know who I am. I've been in office now 10, going on 11 years. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm well known. And uh, they, they trust that I am somebody that will go back there and push back because that's what has typified my career now for, for over 10 years. You came out early on, even before Romney said he's stepping aside, and you said, I'm running in this race, whether Romney's in or not. If I got to run against Romney, I'll run against Romney, that's for sure. And um, so you stood up early. I've endorsed you. I vetted you. You're a very, very stand-up guy, and uh, I think you're a very strong candidate. How does how does it look right now in that convention process with these others who are also seeking this position? Well, I got to tell you, it um, your endorsement, Mark, has gone a long way. I really appreciate that, and and coming out as early as I did, and being that Romney challenger. You know, exhibiting not just in my 10 years in elected office the type of backbone and resolve that I have to stand up to the establishment, but doing it in the way in which I've administered and run my campaign, being the only one to stand up and challenge Mitt Romney. You're right. We were going to do it no matter what. We said we cannot continue with this person as our junior senator in the state of Utah. We need Utah deserves another conservative like Mike Lee. And that's, um, you know, we, we were willing to take him on. And that has really resonated with folks, uh, our, our delegates, that will make a decision at our state convention as to who they want to be the Republican nominee. And that has really resonated with folks. They, they love the way that I had that courage to stand up, uh, push back against uh, Mitt. I said, look, enough is enough. Uh, this guy had promised that he would do certain things, balance budget, end illegal immigration, stop federal spending and overreach, uh, confirm conservative justices to the court, and that's been his his uh, his experience here, and his record has proven just the opposite. Mm -hmm. And so uh, that has really, really resonated. So we're doing great. I think we've got uh, we're in the lead amongst uh, delegates and those that will go to our convention. Uh, they definitely want uh, me in there and be able to work with Senator Lee. And let's move forward. Let's get President Trump back in office and have this contingent of America first constitutional conservative senators and, and congressmen and women that are going to uh, stop us from falling off the cliff with the three plus years we've had of this horrific Biden administration. And, you know, Trent Staggs, if we can't get conservatives out of states like, you know, Utah, Idaho, South Carolina and so forth, you got to wonder where the hell they're going to come from, right? Absolutely. I mean, we we are an incredibly conservative state. We we should be leading out um, and and producing, you know, the types of uh, senators like Mike Lee that are going to be in there and stand up for us and 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 move the country in a in a different direction because the establishment has really just uh, just led us to the brink here, and we we have yeah. to have people stand up. And you and I talked about this at CPAC. And it was great to be able yeah. to visit with you and. And, and we, we're there. We're at this point. We have to have people in office that know what time it is. And they're going to stand up for everyday Americans. 
and not go back to D.C. just to ingratiate themselves with that culture and the uniparty and just try to enrich themselves and just don't care about average mm-hmm. everyday Americans. And we need people that are going to truly represent us. Uh, that's what I've done for over 10 years here in my great community and want to take that back to Washington. Um, as you as you said when we first spoke, that I have that kind of Mr. Smith goes to Washington type of, of background. And um, we, that's, that's something that we need more of in D.C. And I'm, I'm humbled and honored to have the support that we do. If people want to help you, Trent Staggs, because it's, it's a grind and you're going to need the resources and so forth, where do they go? They can go to TrentStags.com. That's S-T-A-G-G-S, TrentStags.com, and uh, help us, uh, support us. You know, I've gotten support from patriots and conservatives all across this country, and I'm very, very humbled to receive that. Even though, you know, if you're outside the state of Utah, this is still a very, very important seat. We get to effectively have a flip here in the U.S. Senate by getting rid of Mm -hmm. Mitt Romney and putting in another constitutional conservative. I'm out of time, Trent Staggs, but I'm guessing Mitt Romney is going to work against you every way humanly possible, which is why you need as much support you can get. TrentStaggs.com, Trent, S-T-A-G-G-S.com. It's on all my social sites. We want to have you back. Take care of yourself and get out there door and door, baby. Take care. Thank you. All right. That's Trent Staggs. He's a really good man.